day 388 of living in the harsh Amazonian rainforest. So I know you guys must be wondering, oh, but Emily, like, how do you go number two in the forest? It's actually very freeing. You just kind of like squat anywhere. And you just kind of like grab a leaf. And what, mom? I'm, I'm trying to look cool here. What do you want? <laughs> oh, um, wait, lasagna? Lasagna? A a extra cheese? Um, okay, uh, sorry guys, I just have to go. Oh no, my, my, uh, my treehouse just fell on a toucan. I'll, I'll be, I gotta go. <laughs> Carly. Yeah, so. <laughs> Hi, I'm Emily, um, singer, dancer, actress, meteorologist, anthropologist, Scientologist, podcast host, and forever student of life. <laughs> also grade nine, where I'm taking care of you in family studies class for six weeks. <laughs> Little Carly. Ooh. Oh, open your eyes. <laughs> Bye. Bye. It was either you or an egg for six weeks. So, but I've heard horror stories of, you know, uh, students turning their eggs into creme brulee. And now I thought it would be nice to make a little video diary for you, Carly. <laughs> now I know you're not real, but, but I want to take this job as seriously as I can. Hi, good morning, Carly. Alexa, turn off whale sounds. Alexa, turn off whale sounds. Alexa. No, I don't have toothpaste on my pimple. <laughs> I don't get acne, I'm like immune, so. All right, just grabbing some quick breakfast cereal today. Mom, where's the milk? You don't have any. So I'm now vegan for the day. <laughs> Our aunt will be proud, Carly. She's a vegan TikToker. So on today's agenda, I have a little drama assignment I have to do. <laughs> it's a Halloween drama project that we had to create. Now, I, I'm not really into Halloween. I think just find that stuff is just wacky. Wait, but aren't <laughs> but... you like a Scientologist? In the name of the mighty sea orc, we, we take that back. He takes it back. <laughs> I'm on a scholarship. Hi guys, so now I'm out for a walk, just taking a break from my studies. I usually allocate about five to seven minutes a day a break. Um, yeah, I don't want to stay in the sun too long. My family has a history of sunburn. I think I'm like half like vampire or something, so. Six feet apart, six feet apart. Um, that's an ant, that's not a person. Are you serious? This is the problem with our generation. No one treats animals and insects like they're people. Like this fly here, he has a family and a wife or husband like so ow <gasps> in jeffrey's honor i will be holding a protest um slash funeral for him it will be open casket hi hi uncle johnny hi how are you uh, i was calling about uh this protest i'm doing so i saw that last year uh during thanksgiving you kind of like passed on the ham when it was going around the table i wasn't sure if you're like vegan or transitioning to a uh, lifestyle of Vegan is um, I want to participate. Hi, Aunt Katie. <laughs> oh, I forgot she bought my number when I named my bacon Peppa Pig. Insects are people and a feeling just like you and me as well. Insects are people and a feeling just like you and me as well. Insects are people and a feeling just like you and me as well. Insects are people. It was a good turnout. Uh, there were some bugs that joined us in the last few minutes. Um, they were kind of like circulating around my arm area. I think because I started wearing orange juice as a natural deodorant. But I also just finished editing my horror movie for drama class. Uh, I feel like that might spread the vegan message faster. I'm sleeping, I'm sleeping. I'm just an innocent girl sleeping in my bed in a suburban town in America. <gasps> I just had an epiphany. Boy, am I craving some dairy product. I'm sleepwalking. Open the handle. Where is the cow pee? This will work. Ah. Can't open it. Ah. Moo, don't eat me. I'm a cow. Sorry.
But there's no tears. You're not crying. I know Peppa is looking down on me, smiling right now. Dedicated to you. <laughs> well, Carly, what a day. <laughs> Your mom is vegan now. So <laughs> that's great. <laughs> I would have thought. I feel like lighter already. <laughs> when you see me in five years, I'm going to be like <laughs> hot air balloons. <laughs> Just less bloated. Ow! Oh, ow. <laughs> Stupid fruit flies. <laughs> Whatever you do, Carly, stand up for what you believe in. Even if there are mean girls named Vanessa who have short hair and a pixie cut and don't care about feelings <laughs> and you want to die when you're around them. <laughs> More info about that later. <laughs> but if you start wearing orange juice, extra pulp as your natural deodorant, good luck, Carly. Okay, now that's done. Ah. <sighs>